Hey guys, so this is Waterloo Station on the day of the uh, Rugby World Cup semi-final between South Africa and New Zealand, I think it is. I really should know. Um, it's actually died down a little bit, <laughs> but it was absolutely packed. But it's pretty cool. Everyone's in really good spirits. There's been some singing, there's been some, uh, some interesting conversations going on. It's been cool. I just thought I'd let you see this. It's kind of the other side of the World Cup. Um, there are obviously the matches and all the competition aspect of it, but I don't know, this is community, this is cool, this is, this is London at its best, this is people at their best. Anyway, enough from me, I'm going to go pick and lock someone. So this is why I wanted to bring you today. This is the Imperial War Museum of London. It's one of my favourite uh, museums in London, it's got some incredible things to see. Uh, indeed, in front of you, you've got two, uh, I don't know what type of guns they are, but they were once mounted on battleships, and the one on the right um, bombarded uh, positions in Normandy uh, during the D-Day landings. And you can also see, towards the bottom left of the picture, a piece of the Berlin Wall. It's pretty cool. Anyway, you know the drill. I'm going to find a place to pick a lock for you, so I'll be right back with you. Hey guys, so the lock lab I've got for you today is a picnic bench outside of the Imperial War Museum. And the lock I've got for you is this Brinks Series 527. Awesome lock, I love it. This is the bitting of the key. That's the thing working and all locked up. So let's see if I can pick it for you. Uh, we're going to use a Sparrow's short hook, which is my favourite pick at the moment. And I can't tell you the binding order. It's um, a simple case of just working your way through the stack, feeling for um, binding pins and picking them. I'm pretty sure there's a uh, there are some serrateds in here. But I'll do a gutting video as a separate video. Preferably somewhere where it's not raining. So I just want to make sure that you can see what's going on with the core. Just make sure we're focused. Okay, that's quite deep false set of pin six. It's pin five giving us some feedback. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> I've got some dogs running around me. <laughs> uh, well, I have no idea if I picked uh, pin five, but um, that was exciting. Bunch of dogs running around the table. Uh, let's see. Okay, really deep false set there. And that feels like pin one giving us some feedback. Okay, I th thought I set pin one. No, I really thought I had it then. Up. Oh. There we go. That is the Brinks 527 picked open. Wonderful lock. Thoroughly recommend it to anyone. Okay. So I shall leave you with a quick shot of the Imperial War Museum. It's not quite so impressive from this angle. But two big old guns does tend to lend gravitas to a facade. Okay guys, um, have a good weekend and I'll see you soon. Cheerio.